Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Mid Island Custom Diecast. My name is Evan, as usual, and in today's build, we will be working on this Norev Citron HY van for the Three Blind Mice Vantastic Invitational. If you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications of future videos. So here's our little Citroen HY van uh, from Norev. Now if you've never heard of the Norev manufacturer, as I hadn't, um, a little history on them. They opened in 1945 making watches for children. In uh, 1953 they got a license from Simca to make their first car model. Uh, and by 1955, they'd opened their first factory in France, making models of cars like the Citroën Traction, Ford Vedette, Panard Dyna, Renault 4 C5, and the Peugeot 203. Um, and have been making car models ever since, I guess. So this uh, Citroën HY van is a recent uh, version obviously and the plan is to create uh, an A-Team van out of it based on the Unconventional Heroes uh, series of renderings created by Gerald Bear and a link to his uh, Facebook post um, of the, all the other vehicles he created uh, will be in the description below so let's move on to the build. So here we've already got it out of the stripper. Um, uh, for some reason, the footage of me taking it apart is lost in the void. But uh, you can see here that we did pretty, pretty good success with the stripper. So we'll go over it once with the wire wheel and uh, get most of the rest of the paint and oxidization off. And all that stuff uh, this van obviously has lots of little lines on it um, which I did take the dental pick to as well after the wire wheel and we'll just get it all nice and cleaned up and ready for a coat of primer uh, so this is the first step in that process and uh, yeah as usual we will also take the red scotch bright wheel also on the Dremel and uh, just give that a once over I find it uh, gives a nice smooth surface, uh, just rough enough uh, for the primer to hold on to. Uh, I've not had much problems with primer coming off when I do this step, so so I keep doing it. And then after a uh, coat of the this is the uh, the chaos black from uh, Citadel in a spray can prime that and uh, now we'll just tape off to add the red stripe that obviously is on the A-Team van uh, so we'll just show you a little bit of the taping because this took me a quite a while to tape but down the one side along across the front and then back up and over uh, the roof at the back doors there so here we are doing the front And uh, yeah, so after this, then we will spray the red and get that done. Um, this is where I came into a bit of trouble with the paint peeling. Um, I went, uh, here it is, the, the red came off when I tried to tape over it for something. Anyway, the, the, it pulled a little bit of the red paint off. I think right after I sprayed the red, it just pulled a little piece off. Um, Anyway, so we went and taped it all back up and sprayed the red back on that section and ended up looking uh, pretty good anyway. Uh, so with the red uh, back in place, then we tape over the entire bottom of the car to add the more gray color on the roof section and the top of the hood and stuff. And now we've sprayed that gray. This is a... 
deep gray black or deep black gray uh, out of a Molotow spray can and here we're just taking the tape off now and praying that we don't pull any more paint off uh, I was planning to do the um, diecast international builders clown car but uh, I just had it was a nightmare of taping and pulling paint off so uh, that video will not be coming out um, anyway here is the van with the gray top and black bottom separated by that red stripe hope B.A. Baracus would be at least amused with this build <laughs> I know I was so now onto the wheels. I uh, found these, uh, I believe, are uh, monoblock wheels, but they may be from uh, some other premium Hot Wheels. I'm not too sure. But as you can see, they're gold. Uh, they're close to the same 10-spoke design uh, or whatever was on. I can't remember how many spokes were actually on the 18 van, but... Um, yeah, more than 10 it looks like. Uh, anyway, these are what we're going to use. Um, we'll get them into the spray booth and put some primer on them. Here is that. Sprayed them with the black primer. Again, same Chaos Black as before, I believe. Although this may be out of the airbrush. I can't particularly remember, but that doesn't matter. So we got them with the black. Uh, cover up that gold. Then we'll move on to the red. I use the same as is Roman red from Splash Paints, and uh, then after that we'll put a. After we let this dry, we put a nice clear coat on just to give them a bit of shine. All right, moving on, moving on. There we go. Uh, yeah, so there they are with the clear coat. You can see they're a bit shined up. I think they're looking pretty good, so we will uh, put on the tires now. So uh, these probably aren't the same uh, tires as the 18 van, um, the Toyo tires, but I think they look good on there. Uh, they're the right sort of profile tire, and um, yeah, I mean, it's what I had, so it's what we used. And, uh, yeah, we'll just speed through the rest of these. No problem, no scrape paint, no not, no issues whatsoever. So we'll leave those, set those aside. And here's the, um, the interior section of the van, which I literally did nothing to because you can barely see through um, the windshield and stuff. Uh, and there's the base unit uh, piece. And um, what I did here is I used the actual brass uh, axles that come with the monoblock wheels and just test fitted them here. Um, at this point, I did have to take it all apart, grind the, um, the wheel wells a bit more, and uh, repaint the bottom section of the van, obviously because I had ground off some of the black paint. Uh, but luckily that was a fairly painful process uh, that I did not put on camera because I was upset. Uh, but that's okay. Anyway, here are those brass uh, axles that I was telling you about. Monoblock sends with the, with the wheels and tires. Um, you just take the ends and crimp them a little bit and that holds the, the wheels on. No problem at all. Nice spin, no problem. So uh, we will put these in and um, do the final assembly and while we're doing that uh, well here it is yeah the assembly is done and you can see the wheels are a little bit rough in there so at this point that's when I go and I grind them out again anyway while I'm doing that off camera and putting it all back together let's have a look at where we started with a absolutely plain silver color i guess citron hy and here is where we ended up uh, so i did a little detailing on the front uh, for the headlight pieces there uh, i polished up the windshield a little bit but this was a brand new casting 
uh, that I ordered from eBay a f a quite a few months ago with this exact build in mind, so I uh, didn't need much work. Um, repainted the bottom section black, the upper part sort of a dark gray, obviously the red stripe, uh, red wheels, which I think um, are a pretty good match to the uh, original BA Baracus van. I uh, wish I would have put some detail on the tail lights in the back there and stuff, but, uh, uh, well, I forgot. So, uh, no biggie. Uh, I am happy with this build. I hope you all are as well. Uh, if you do like it, please hit that like button. Uh, like I said at the beginning of the video, if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so and ringing that bell. Uh, got a couple more builds, a few more builds coming out this summer, uh, end of the month, July, hopefully got a hearse coming out, and then the Gaslands build for the Three Blind Mice, uh, and a double casting movie theme build at the end of August, and who knows, maybe I'll fit a few more in there, um, in between. Anyway, uh, thanks for joining me again, and, um, leave you with a few glamour shots.